Okay, so we've got, got yep, we've got yep. Avi, we've got Logan Blake. They're going to debate organic. Uh, Logan's the one with contention, so you open up with whatever your criticism is. Go ahead. Okay, I, know I said I only have like one minute, so I don't know why we're calling this a debate, but I'm just saying the graph that you sent me has to has do to with, do with nit nitrogen input, correct? Correct. Nitrogen input as measured by manu by nitrogen applied to soils, and soils meaning crops. Okay, so they're, they're measuring the mm -hmm. amount of nitrogen, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Okay, so would from, you from agree, manure. Sure. Okay, would you agree that all fertilizers don't have the same amount of nitrogen in them? Yeah, that's right. It's in fact, it's a steel man for your position because <laughs> because chickens have more nitrogen per mass of chicken fertilizer than cattle does, and yet there's still okay. more cattle nitrogen. No, that's incorrect, incorrect because, because uh -huh. all, all chicken all litter chicken is not created equal. It's not all on the a, same on average on a, on a, yeah sure, but on the average, it has more nitrogen. No, no, no. Because yes, I, it does. I, 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 mm -hmm. The stuff that I looked up, it was way different. You could find one, one with just a just small amount. Sure, you can, you can absolutely you can absolutely can, but on the average, it is more. On the average, do you yeah, have yeah, well, sure, 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 yeah, yeah, and we can go okay, through all the calculations if you'd like it. Sure. Send that over to Nick, and we'll look at that Dad, because sure. I don't know where you're finding, finding all this. All it's from the it's from the FAO. It's from the yeah, sure. It's from it's the data from the FAO. The data from the FAO clearly shows that the majority of manure that is used is from cattle and if you do it by mass if you calculate it by mass you actually get the uh, greater difference cows actually are have a greater amount of manure production than chickens do and if you do it by on the on average if you do it by nitrogen that difference actually shrinks now cows still win either way no matter how you slice the data but because chickens on average have more nitrogen than manure than cows do the difference actually shrinks and chickens actually look a little bit better they almost they may even okay. come to half but, it, but yeah, so either way, cows win across the board, but it's actually a steel man for you for me to use nitrogen because on average, chicken manure has more nitrogen content per mass than cow manure. Ah, well, I mean, you'll have to show me that. Because that. I, okay, yeah, sure, no problem. No problem. Because last time you said a whole bunch of shit, shit. in that mm -hmm. other debate, and then when I, when I looked it up later, it was all wrong. Well, 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 we can talk about that. We can talk about that, too. We can, I'm sure we, we, can, we can talk about it. So you can send me what your contentions were there. So what do you think I was, you can send me what you think I was wrong about there as well. Cool, cool. So and well, you can cool. send me the data. Like and you can, right? you can, Cal you can, you can Cal send me that, too, Logan. Logan. Okay. Well, okay. you, know, well, you can you send know, me that too. Up to for yourself. Up to for yourself. Can... Cows in China are low uh, on the fertilizer scale. They use pigs a lot more, more and, and other things. Other things. So, China, oh, China. oh, hold on, hold on. We can look that. We can look that up right now. Actually, would you, you like to? You can. Yeah, Wait, you would, can you, would you? Would you like to do that? Okay. And, uh, you know, send uh, you know, Would you? Sure. Mm -hmm. Would. Mm -hmm. We can. It's in the study archive. Are you in the study archives? No, but I, I'm wondering how come you didn't send me a graph that, that showed, showed what mm -hmm. fertilizer is used the most instead of st sending me one that one has that nothing. Has sure, to sure. The reason, the reason, yeah. So, so the reason, the reason I did that is because the FAO has their standard of using a proxy of nitrogen to do it. That's the reason I did that. And in order to actually get to it by mass, the FAO doesn't do it by mass. They don't see the point of doing it by mass because the whole point of we're doing it is for the nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium in the first place. However, if you want to do that, you can calculate it. And I did. I went through the, I went through the process of actually back calculating it into the mass and cal calculating from independent data even into the mass. And even and in that case, when you do it by mass, cows actually went out even more than chickens. Then you, they oh, would okay. buy you by you, you telling me you found every single company that sells chicken litter? No, 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 no. Oh, whoa, now, oh, that's a nice slip, Logie Bear. No, so what I'm okay. saying is that based on the FAO data, based on the FAO data, Logie Bear, Logie, Logie, Logie Bear, Logie Bear, Logie, listen. I'm basing it. I'm not saying that every single, I don't need to show you that every single instance and every atomization of farm has been calculated. All I'm saying is that on the aggregate, whatever the FAO data has, has derived from, whatever they've calculated, and this is the best source of it. I know if you, have, if you have a better source that's done better calculations or has collected better data, you can name it. But based on the FAO, is he gone? Oh, okay, cool. 
Avi, if you want to complete your point so that it's on the recording. recording. Sure, sure. Yeah. So based on everything that, you know what, let me just, I, I'll send it in general chat. If you are looking in general chat right now, yep, here the is, on the recorder's on chat. okay, I want to show you this. Okay. So this is a screenshot for, this is data from the USDA. Um, so here's, and there's also data from the FAO. So there's the amount of pounds, if we're doing it by mass, pounds per day per uh, 100,000 pound animal unit. And they have chickens, broilers, beef and dairy. And then we, what other data do we have here? Here are, here is the number of chickens, by the way. The number of chickens in it, in that we have. And was this, Log where was Logan's uh, claim about how many chickens there were? Because he actually just made up a number, by the way. Um, so here, here was Logie Bears. So this is what his claim was. Did some research. Turns out the most commonly used fertilizer is chicken litter. It's used in organic and conventional farms because of its low cost. Makes perfect sense when you think about it. There's like 60 billion farm animals out there and 59 billion of them are chickens. There's more chickens in just the USA than there are people in the world. This buy conventional of organic because blood meal though is dumb as fuck. So it says the most commonly used manure based fertilizer used both conventional and organic farms is chicken litter. Okay, so he actually just made up a number. If you notice that he said 59 billion, it's not 59 billion. It's actually according to Statistica. And according you can, if you can have any other source, if you'd like, I challenge you to get me a number of chickens, 59 billion. It's about 22 billion, but we'll get there because even if you use 59 billion, the numbers still don't come out in his favor. So let's do the math. So the average boiler weight, here's, I'm post, and I'm posting my math in general. So if, guys, I know it's like, I know it's entertaining and everything to post in the chat, but if you could just hold off from posting in the chat so, so we can complete the point. Um, so I'm gonna just gonna ask to minimize comments in general chat so just I can post It's them. actually it's okay, exactly. Avi. I'm opening the things as you post them so they're on screen. People, if they talk- No, but this is text. Them. This is text. Yeah, I can keep okay, it, on, can your keep your it text. on your text. Don't, don't okay. worry about that. I'll, I'll about keep that. it on whatever I'll you're keep saying. It on. Okay, fine. All right, so let me copy this. Paste, so we have the average boiler right here, the average weights and the average cattle because remember the units are in weight are in the units they gave are if the usda gives is pounds per day per uh, thousand pounds of anim animal unit number of chickens worldwide let's steel man everything so basically i steel man him by assuming even if i assume we only assume that there's boilers because the product of the boiler weight multiplied by the output is going to be greater uh than the hen the hen hen laying chickens and I also still meant him assuming that all cows were dairy because if they were beef, the product of the product of that multi that weight multiplied by that output would be greater. So I still meant him in terms of assuming the chickens would be producing the most manure, and I still meant him in terms of the cattle would be producing the least manure. And we simply do the math. And here's what we get. So what we get is, even with all these steel men, we get almost 10 times as much manure by mass as produced by the cows as they are with chickens. And then, even if we go with Logie Bear's made up number, even if we go with his made up number of 59 billion, which is far more chickens than there are in the world, we still don't get more manure being produced by chickens. So here's the math for that. And we're still, still doesn't work. So even if we use every steel man, we use made up numbers that Logie pushed, doesn't work. And here is the data from manure applied to soil in tons of nitrogen. And as we can see, this is from, this is from the FAO, the numbers actually get closer. The numbers actually get closer. And the reason they get closer is because chicken manure actually has more nitrogen in it than, than cattle manure does on the average. Again, this is worldwide. So here's the data for that. Do you see that highlighted thing right there, Logie? 
That's a chicken. Okay. Chat, you can talk again. I'm done posting data. Alrighty. So okay. as you can see, yeah, yeah. As you can see, the uh, the nitrogen actually comes closer. It almost comes to about half of that. Despite the fact that there's so much more manure mass from cows than there are chicken, the nitrogen is almost half of that because chicken litter actually has far more nitrogen than cattle does um, when it comes to apply to soils on some data. Uh, if you do it across by years, if, by in 2010. So the difference, discrepancy in that data may be because one is high in a, in a different year than another. But the point still remains that they actually come closer by with, when you do it by nitrogen. When you do it by mass, total amount of manure produced, it actually has a greater increase and cows are having even more manure. Is there anything else you would like to say to Logan or about what was said here before I close the recording? Logie Bear, set up a date and time, keep, give a promise, keep your word, and I'll be happy to debate. <laughs>